Okay, now that you have downloaded the software and you know a little bit about it, um, the next thing we need to do before you can actually use the Smart Response System is to name your class. If you come down to your toolbar at the bottom of your screen, you'll see a little yellow box it has a tiny white rectangle inside that's supposed to represent the remote. You mouse over it, it says Smart Response. If it's not there, um, take your little arrow and slide it out so that you can see the hidden icons and it should be there. If you click on that little yellow icon, you're going to get several options. You want the second option which says Teacher Tools, and you'll see the Smart Response starting to open up. And then when you're opening to the Teacher Tools, the first thing it says, type a classroom name for your receiver. Um, this is where you want to type in what your students know is, is your classroom, so they're not accidentally answering another teacher's question. This is not the place for you to name different classes, like if you teach different periods, don't put period one or period two. We'll get to that later on in the tutorial. Um, the easiest thing to do is just to name this by your last name, or if you want to put um, you know, like your last name and what you teach. It only takes about eight letters, and my whole name won't even fit because I do have a long name, but my students know that that's me. Um, so. Whatever name that you want to give your classroom, if you want to title it your room number, room 217, or whatever number you happen to be in. Um, so come up with a class name, hit begin, and then right now mine says mine isn't ready. I don't have it ready because I don't have anything plugged in. Um, that is probably what yours says as well because you need to actually plug the receiver in to use it. Um, but that's all you have to do. Your name, your name is in there. When you get to the point that you're ready to use it and you plug it in, your students will be able to sign in under your name and know that that is your classroom. So you are ready to move on to the next step.